All right, I'm here to talk about Dragon Hunter. We're gonna do this in series. So uh, one section at a time. This is violin one. I'm gonna start at the very beginning. I'm gonna go through measure four. So first measure, B on the A string, three counts. One, two, three, A's on four. One, two, three, four. Second measure, four quarter notes. A, G, F sharp, B. Don't, don't hold that note too long and don't crush it either. Just play it. And you rest for three counts. So that's pretty easy. Our dynamic here is forte. That little F below the first note means forte, means loud. And we're going to hold it for three counts again. And with the down bow, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So that is the first four measures. Now I'm going to work on measures four through 12. And I'm reading out of a score, so I might have to stop a couple of times. I'm probably not going to be able to play through large sections at a time. So let's start with four through seven. This key is in this song is in the key of D major, so it has two sharps, so F sharp and C sharp. I don't know if there are, I haven't looked ahead to see if there are any F naturals or C naturals yet. So our first pattern in measure four, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, up. <laughs> Before you even play anything, instead of trying to play the measure, play the rhythm first in your bow. When you get more advanced, you can play the open strings uh, on the notes that you're playing. In this case, D, 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 D. So let's look at our notes. We got E. So E, E, D, E, E, D. One, open one. And then the second measure, E minor scale. Four eighth notes followed by two quarter notes. Same rhythm in measure six, so we don't have to repeat learning that. So just E, keep your fingers over the notes. If you have a tuner, you can have your tuner beside you when you're playing, so you can check to make sure that you're actually catching the notes as you play them. I've got my tuner here. It's telling me every note that I'm playing. Measure six. E, F sharp, G, A, B. seven three quarter notes C sharp A B so here's six and seven so let's, let's do all of four through eight Don't be afraid to move your bow for these notes. It's still loud. We don't want to go. That's not what we want either. Just... All right. And then eight repeats a lot of four. So four and five are identical. After you learn the notes, play through the section so that you can play them without having to stop. So I'm going to skip to 10, and we've got quarter, eighth, eighth, quarter, eighth, eighth, dotted half note, two, three, and we're going to talk about
about this at 11. So let's hear that once. And the next section going into 12 will be a new section. Right? Practice G, A, B, C sharp, D, C sharp, B. If you can play it like that, adding the rhythms will be much easier. One, two, three. Now, when you're just about done playing measure 11, the third beat of the Half note. One, two, three. You're going to cut off a little early. You notice you also have a comma in measure 11, so that means take a breath. Two, three. And then on beat four, we're going to come back all the way back to the frog. One, two, three, lift. Very carefully. That's going to cue in the cellos at measure 12. All right. Now I'm going to go all the way through uh, to 18 because 18 is a different section. Now we've got our first slur of the piece. So that's down, up, down, open. One, two, three. And again, the same thing we did in 11. One, two, three. All the way back to the frog. talk about ooh, 13 same same thing as 11 so if you practice 11 it's the same so 14 is all eighth notes one and two and three and four and one two three four one two three four twice as many two three and four and one two three and four and Two and three. Now let's apply the notes. So we've got D, C sharp, B, D, C sharp, B, A, C sharp. If you need to write in a couple of fingerings to remind you how this goes, that's fine. All on the A string. But if you have to practice it slowly, that's fine too. 15, 16, and 17. Half note, quarter, quarter, half note, quarter, quarter, half note. Up, up. Little space between each note. Stop there. So let's see. 15, half note. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2. <clears throat> Just play the bowings first. Practice 17 by itself, that's fine too. So start at the, t the end of the measure. Control that. Got good hand position. You notice that I'm not holding my instrument up like that, but I'm keeping my wrist as straight as I can. So I'm going to do from 12. Pickups to 12. One, two, lift. One, two. One, two. One, two. 
to and stop right there. All right, so that is the beginning to measure 18. Good luck and happy practicing.